today I give you guys the final Comic Con recap video, and this time it's all video game related, so stick around and find out what video games are turning into movies. Alright guys, welcome back. This is uh, the final recap I'm doing for Comic Con. It's going to be in group form. Uh, some of the things that we're going to be talking about are not as interesting as others, but here we go. Uh, the first thing I want to tell you guys is that Comic Con introduced and they said that they were making a Dead Space movie and that they finally have the writer. No, don't get excited. Don't. The writer to this thing is the guy that wrote Street Fighter The Legend of Chung Li. I had the privilege or the despair of watching this film, and this film is horrible writing, acting, the film is just bad. So the fact that EA says that they want to push this and make it into a franchise, yet they hand it off to this guy, it's just kind of sad, really. It's sad. I mean, how do you guys give it to this guy when his writing in the last one was horrible? But whatever. So yeah, we're getting a Dead Space movie that's probably going to suck because the writer's going to suck. Only way this movie gets saved is if possibly a cool director takes it, but I doubt it. It's going to be sucky, guys. Just letting you guys know right now it's going to suck. But we're getting a Dead Space movie, guys. We're getting one. Justin Sparks is going to be the one that's writing this, along with the only saving grace here that we also have is that it's going to be with the guy that wrote I Am Legend. He's going to be like overseeing it. So maybe he'll see how bad the writing is. He'll tell EA and be like, guys, let me take care of this. But pretty much we're getting a Dead Space movie, guys. Let me know what you guys think. Are you guys Dead Space fans? Have you guys ever played the video game? I have. I've played 3, played part of 2, part of 1. I enjoyed 3, although it got trashed. Um, played the co-op elements of it. I thought it was fun. Uh, but let me know what you guys think below. Comment. Make sure you guys like and subscribe also. But comment and let me know what you guys think. Alright guys, so this was something cool that really happened at Comic-Con and I was shocked. They had a teaser for the World of Warcraft movie. Yes, a teaser trailer, guys. That actually means that they've been working on the film and have, like, the atmosphere and the world created already. Um, I haven't heard anything about, like, the casting or anything, but that means that they've been working on it. And that's great potential, guys. We have potential for something that could be possibly really, really cool. And I'm actually kind of excited. I don't really play World of Warcraft but I understand it has a huge fan base. I've seen it, never really got into it, but I do understand that it's a major, big world, and I don't know, after like hearing all the fans' reaction and all the different websites' reactions to this, I am actually pretty excited about this. I think this could possibly be something really, really cool, and who knows, man. World of Warcraft is coming soon, so I'm excited. The main reasons I'm excited about this are the fact that the director of this is an absolutely phenomenal director to me, a great up and coming director. He directed the film um, Moon and he also directed Source Code. His name is Duncan Jones. He, in those two movies alone, I give him all the props. I hope that he's able to do what he wants with the film and give his perspective on it. I, I'm excited about it. Uh, the film is supposed to start shooting in 2014. But what they showed in the TV trailer was actually like uh, like footage of the effects and like things like that from what I heard. But I'm excited, guys. Uh, let me know what you guys are excited about. If you guys are excited about uh, World of Warcraft, uh, this is working out perfectly because the last thing we're talking about are all gaming related. The last piece of gaming related news that we have here is that Clementine will be in the season two of Tall Tales Walking Dead. Yes. It has been confirmed she will be in season two the panel has talked about it they said she's guaranteed to be in it she's gonna be a major character in it so get excited about that they also showed a teaser image of Clementine a little bit older and she has a child with her a young young child so interesting perspective uh, I'm not sure if we're gonna be playing as Clementine but the fact that she has to take care of a child that she must have found or something like that is amazingly interesting and I just can't wait to see what we get from this I love the Walking Dead Telltale game I have a review up I love it guys uh, but I'm super excited and I can't wait to see what they're gonna do with this but they did say that they are gonna answer a lot of the questions that were left open from the season one such as Kenny's death and what ended up happening to him if he actually died if he didn't die so if you guys have been excited about this this is some fantastic news for you guys for me I'm super excited about this can't wait to see what else they do with this um just excited guys I want you guys comment below and let me know what you guys think and 
like and subscribe guys like and subscribe make sure you guys let me know about all those things plus the world of warcraft movie on um, comment below like this video and subscribe and as always guys i'll see you guys later